what's up youtube and this your girl comedic medium prophetess and i'm back with another video angel number seven on the clock if you're new to my channel i read out and even angel numbers i don't just read those numbers for for nothing when i call out a number uh go look those numbers up okay if you're new to my channel i'm also a psychic medium i'm able to connect with those who have crossed over okay so check out some of my psychic medium reads i haven't done a while done one in a while so uh i'll try to get back to those when i can you know uh me being a psychic medium i don't just tap into um i don't know why i'm saying this i think somebody that watches my channel they want to know it um, the reason why I don't do, um, psychic medium reads all the time is because I have to ask permission from that certain individual ancestors and stuff like that. I can't just read people. I don't tap into the deceased unless they want to be tapped into, like they may reach out to me. Okay. Or, or one of their ancestors or relatives or in the spiritual realm. So I don't just tap into people just to do that. That goes for not just celebrities. That goes for regular people too. Anyhow, I want to make this download quick and like quick, fast in a hurry because I'm tired and I want to relax. Okay. I love you guys. <clears throat> Anyway, so I'm getting a download. So I was just laying here closing my eyes and I seen a post office worker. Again, I seen a POST office worker. Okay, somebody's landlord, property manager, leasing agency. Um, somebody is stealing your mail. This could be somebody in your community. Somebody could have broken into your mailbox. OK, if you live in a home and you pay mortgage, if you own your home, this could be an ex lover that's driving past your house late at night. They could secretly try to put cameras up around your house or your home. OK, this is some type of ex lover that breaks into your mailbox at night. If you own a home, if you stay in an apartment complex or a condo or some type of building. OK, because I'm seeing somebody like walk in a building and check in. OK, so you may live like in a, a apartment complex where I don't know, you may live in like a like a condo or something like a downtown area. OK, or you may end up having to move to that type of area or something like that. Spirit, I'm hearing I'm, I'm hearing like a lot of heavy moving energy. Spirit may end up calling you to move or spirit is about to move you somewhere to a safer area or a safer place. OK. I'm hearing your landlord. Or your property manager or your leasing agency or whoever you pay your mortgage to somebody is stealing your mail somebody is stealing your mail and hacking into your mailbox or this could be an ex-lover or something like that that's doing this either way it go if this is a ex-lover they have some type of connections to your landlord your leasing agency i don't fucking know okay now an ex-lover may not even be involved with this OK, an ex lover may not be involved with this at all. OK, I'm hearing unexpected income. OK, I feel like your community, OK, your community or somebody that knows you in your community. I don't know. Listen, I'm getting a heavy download. I'm getting download after download. I feel like if you live in an apartment complex or if you live in a condo, like if you if you the condominiums I'm hearing or if like a town home or a duplex, I don't know where you live. I feel like there is some type of unexpected income that's supposed to come come to you. And I feel like your community could know about this. You could have cut somebody off. I'm hearing like an ex friend or an ex lover that lives close to you. And this person could owe you money or you can secretly be a millionaire or I'm hearing the news. I'm hearing like I'm getting download after download. I'm hearing somebody that's in high places could be trying to contact you or reach out to you. OK, somebody could be a federal agent here. I'm hearing that somebody knows that you didn't get their letter. I feel like somebody could have thought that you were ignoring them or you don't want to be with them or you're not interested in them. So somebody could be attracted to you. I feel like somebody knows that you didn't get their letter or you didn't get their message. Somebody was supposed to reach out to you. Somebody was supposed to give you some type of money or some type of inheritance. Angel number 444 on the clock. I'm hearing something has something to do with an ex-lover, an ex-friend, possibly even a mother. 
or a father or your whole inside your family. Okay, I'm hearing I'm hearing gossiping. I'm hearing the word gossiping. I'm hearing the word rumors. I feel like there is some type of rumors or gossip going around the community that I feel like somebody could have lied to your leasing office, your landlord. Somebody could have lied to a neighbor, an ex-friend. You or your friend can live down the street from you or around the corner from you or an ex-lover. Or you could have moved away from these people. I don't know. But somebody lied to somebody in your community, whether that's somebody you pay rent to, mortgage to, or whoever this ex-lover is a friend is. I don't know. Somebody lied and called and said that you were in trouble, that you were going to jail, that you were a criminal. Somebody could be trying to get you put out of a home. Somebody could be trying to cause you to be homeless. I don't know. But I feel like there is a bunch of gossip and rumors going around about some type of unexpected income. I feel like whoever's been stealing your mail, they either been breaking into your mailbox late at night, okay, because they don't want this unexpected income to come to you, or they got connections at the post office. This person could know somebody in the post office, and this person that works at the post office is about to be fired. I'm hearing it's going to be a federal case because there was some type of unexpected income or some type of mail, angel number 619 on the clock, that was supposed to come to you and you didn't receive it. And I feel like somebody's feelings is hurt. Somebody could have thought that you just took their money. Somebody could have sent you something like a care package or somebody could have sent you something to help you or something like that. Or just somebody wanted to be generous and send you money or a gift. Or I feel like somebody has been sending you several gifts, lots of money or something, and you haven't been receiving it. I'm hearing because somebody in your your apartment manager or I feel like if your apartment manager or your landlord, because you can live in an apartment, you can live in dupl a duplex, you can live in a condo because I'm hearing somebody can live in a luxury condo or a luxury apartment or something or you're going to end up moving to something like that I feel like you're not the only person I'm hearing slumlord you're not the only person that this person been stealing from this person steals everybody meal and I'm hearing they've already been caught on camera I'm hearing there's some type of secret camera that could be by your mailbox I'm hearing like you could have purchased the camera Angel number 723 on the clock, you could have purchased a camera because you could have suspected that somebody could have been stealing your mail because you could have been waiting on some type of package or something like that. Somebody has been stealing your mail. OK, I don't know if this is your landlord. OK, I don't know if this is a neighbor. OK, but I'm hearing like breaking into the mailbox. OK, I feel like there is some type of gossip or some type of rumor going around that you're supposed to be getting some type of unexpected income. I feel like an ex-lover, a friend, or somebody in your community or somebody you don't fuck with no more that's hating on you. Somebody could have called your landlord, your leasing agency, or whoever the hell you pay your mortgage to, okay? I'm hearing a mortgage company, but I can't think of a mortgage company name, okay? Somebody could be a realtor, a realtor or something like that. Somebody could be a realtor or something like that. I don't know. But um, anyways, I feel like there is some type of rumor and gossip going around that um, you can have some type of unexpected income or you're supposed to be like a millionaire. Y'all got to forgive me when I pause and stuff. That may not be getting a download, but spirit is telling me that. Somebody is saying you're supposed to be a millionaire or somebody is saying that you I don't know. Somebody told some type of lie. OK, somebody could have said that you were going to be arrested or you were going to go to jail or something like that. There's some type of gossip or rumors going around your community involving some type of unexpected income that's supposed to be given to you. This could be a wealthy man or a wealthy woman. OK, this could be a federal agent. This could be anybody. This could be somebody that's wealthy. Or something like that that's been wanting to I feel like somebody has I'm, I'm hearing hurting of the feelings I feel like somebody feelings is hurt I feel like somebody's feelings is no longer hurt but I feel like at one point somebody's was feelings was hurt because they felt like you were ignoring them you wasn't responding to their mail okay I feel like somebody has some type of connections to the post office that's what I'm hearing I feel like somebody has some type of connections to the post office or something like that. I feel like if somebody got some connections to the post office, whoever been destroying your mail, 
that works in this post office, they're going to jail. I feel like there's a, I feel like there is some type of gossiping and rumors going around your, your community about some type of unexpected income that's supposed to go towards you. But I feel like if your landlord or whoever you pay your mortgage to or this leasing agency or whatever, whoever you, if this person, whoever you pay your rent to or mortgage to, if this person has been breaking into your mailbox, I'm hearing you're not the only person that mailbox that they break into. I feel I'm hearing unexpected income. I feel like there is some type of rumor going around about you supposed to be a millionaire or some type of unexpected income is supposed to come to you and I feel like your whole community could be gang stalking you or something like that your whole community the from the leasing agency apartment manager condo manager I don't know where you live at town home duplex or you may own your home so if your spirit is saying if you own your home, then some type of ex-lover or ex-friend could be breaking into your mailbox. But I'm hearing somebody is going to be caught on camera. Okay, somebody's going to be caught on camera still in mail. Spirit is also telling me if you if you haven't been receiving your mail, Spirit is saying that you may need to go online and register. If you're in the United States, if you live in overseas, I don't know how that work. But if you're in the United States, Spirit is saying you need to go online and register with the U.S. Post Office because I feel like there's some type of app you can download. It's free. There's some type of app you can download and you can see like your daily mail. You can see what your mail what mail is coming to you what mail you haven't received because I feel like either this ex-friend like if you live in a house I'm seeing like your ex-lover or your ex-friend has been coming late at night disguised I feel like somebody has been coming like in a jumpsuit in a ski mask breaking into your mailbox because they don't want you to receive some type of unexpected income and I'm hearing they've been caught on camera Either they're doing this or either your landlord, your leasing agency or whoever you pay. Somebody got connections to the post office. So if somebody is not actually breaking into your mailbox, either way it go. If they broke into your mailbox, they've been caught on camera. Somebody could actually be digging in your trash as well. I feel like there's several people. There could be a lot of people in your community that wants to get into your business. They want to know how you make your money. There's some type of rumor or gossip going around about you supposed to be a millionaire or some type of unexpected income or some type of wealthy man. Somebody is looking for somebody. Somebody is looking for somebody. Somebody is trying to find somebody. And I'm hearing feelings hurt. Somebody feels like you're ignoring them. Somebody feels like you took their money or somebody feels like you don't want them or you're not interested. I feel like somebody is discovering that you never received their mail. Either this is somebody that wants to date you or this is somebody that wants to be generous. But I'm hearing somebody is about to move. I feel like somebody is looking for somebody here. Okay. That's what I'm hearing. But I'm hearing if somebody, whoever this ex-friend is, this ex-lover is. So it could be an ex-friend. It could be an ex-lover or it could be a landlord, a more a leasing agency, a mortgage company. I don't know. Or all of these people could be working in cahoots. I'm hearing a mother, a father of your whole entire family. I'm hearing an ex-lover, a friend, a landlord. A lot of people could be working in cahoots. I'm hearing gang stalking in your community. I'm hearing cameras. People could be digging in your trash, trying to get in your business. OK, I feel like these people started off digging in your trash and they couldn't find anything in your trash trash so now they starting to break into your mailbox okay if these people having a i mean you may need to check your mailbox for like any dents or bit or bending or anything like that you may need to like record your mailbox or something like that you may need to wait on the post office you may need to wait on the wait on the um the poster service, you may need to find out when they deliver your mail and have a conversation with them, okay, or something like that. I don't know. You need to record. I'm hearing you need to record something or video something. I'm hearing if somebody, I feel like if this, if these people have not been breaking into your mailbox, somebody has some connections at the post office and they've been destroying your mail. I'm hearing somebody is finna go to jail. I mean, this is a federal case because I'm hearing whoever's been sending you this mail could be a federal agent or this could be somebody that's very wealthy that could help you hire an attorney or a lawyer. OK, somebody has been looking for somebody, somebody. I don't know, man. I'm hearing overseas. I'm hearing marriage. OK, I feel like some I'm here. I'm hearing feelings hurt. I feel like somebody feels like their feelings has been hurt. I mean, this could be somebody's confirmation. So when you get this message, this is my angel number 1444 on the clock. This could be your 
your confirmation. Okay, I feel like there's some type of rumor or gossip going around your community. I feel like somebody could have called wherever you live. Somebody could have called an ex-friend, an ex-lover, a mother, a father, a family member. Somebody could have called and said that you were going to jail. You were going to be arrested. Okay, these people could be trying to make up lies to get you evicted from a home or to be homeless. I feel like somebody could be dealing with a slumlord or something. Somebody that don't fix shit. Okay, or... You you could be renting a home. You might not be owning your home. You could have a landlord that don't fix shit. They like, I feel like I'm hearing sewage. Somebody could have like sewage backup. Somebody could be selling drugs in your community. Okay. I feel like somebody could be selling. Somebody could have a secret meth lab or something like that. Okay, so neighbors could be involved. I don't know. I'm just seeing all different type of people. I feel like somebody could be on meth or whoever you pay your mortgage to or your rent to. Somebody could be a meth head or a heroin addict or something like that. I'm hearing major exposure. Something is going to go viral. Okay. But whoever's been hiding your mail or destroying your mail at the post office, if, because that's not for everybody, if somebody is at the post office destroying your mail, I'm hearing that they're going to jail, okay? This is a federal case. I'm hearing because whoever's been sending you these gifts is a wealthy man or a wealthy woman. Either this person wants to date you or court you, or either this person is just trying to be generous. This could have been an ex. This Now, this could be a good person. This could be a good ex-friend or a good ex-lover that's trying to connect with you or reach out to you. But I'm hearing moving. Somebody is about to move. I'm hearing somebody's going to have to move because I'm hearing this is it's a war in your community. I feel like there's I feel like several people are trying to get their hands. They're trying to know how you make your money. They're trying to figure out several people. I feel like your community could be gang stalking you. OK, whoever you pay your mortgage to your rent to these people know that there's some type of unexpected income that's coming to you. And this, there's, a, there's some type of rumors and gossip going on. These people are trying to look into your trash, hack into your mailbox because they want to steal this money from you so you don't get it. These people could also be working with your karmic family or friends or ex-lovers to try to cause you to be homeless or broke or ass that. I'm hearing there's always going to be a ram in the bush. You don't have anything to worry about. God is going to protect you if you have children or if you don't have children, even if you're by yourself, if you're single or you you're in a relationship with your significant other for some of you if you're in a relationship with somebody that could be secretly the enemy this person could be working with the community or something like that that some, somebody's karmic lover could be betraying them somebody could be sleeping with the enemy okay you need to separate from this person okay but i'm hearing that this is the main thing that i'm hearing you need to down if, if you know if you suspect that somebody has been stealing your mail OK, I feel like these people could have started off people in your community could have started digging in your trash, but they didn't find shit. OK, so now they decided to hack and break into your mail because there's some type of unexpected income that's supposed to go to, towards you. Spirit is also telling me that this landlord or this mortgage company or this ex lover or this ex friend, they could have already stole this unexpected income out of your mailbox. OK, I don't know. You can stay. I don't know if you stay in a house, a duplex, an apartment, a condo. Somebody could have already stole a neighbor or whatever. Whoever these people is, they all could have got a cut. Somebody could have already stole your unexpected income. They're all going to jail because I'm hearing something has been caught on camera. OK, I'm hearing something has been caught on camera. OK, I feel like the, if you live in an, a, a condo or do play, if you if you pay, if you live like in a community, like a gated community or, you know, I don't know if you live in something like that. I'm hearing there's some type of secret camera that your landlord or your mortgage person, somebody don't know that there's a secret camera. Somebody has been caught on camera, like breaking into your mailbox. Somebody is going to jail. OK, I'm hearing in the next two to three days or you're going to you're going to I feel like it. Listen. What you need to do is whoever you are that I'm talking to, because this this reading may resonate for a lot of people. You need to download it's this app that you can download. Matter of fact, I know because I have it myself. OK, and I make sure I get my meals. OK, nobody do shit to me. So if you if you if you dealing with this situation, I'm getting a download right now. You need to go on the U.S. post office if you stay in America. And you need to download this app and it will let you know what mail, what mail is coming and going. OK, 
And I feel like somebody could have a meth lab in your community or something like that. Somebody could be, somebody could be, somebody could be on meth. Somebody could be a meth, meth lab. Okay. So you may live in an apartment or a condo or a duplex, or I don't know, you may share like a, a building with somebody and somebody may cook meth and you may smell like funny smells or so I feel like somebody is going to be busted. Okay, for being having a meth lab or something like that. Y'all, this is a heavy ass channeling. This is a lot going on, but whoever been breaking into your mailbox, you're not the only person that they break into. Somebody is going to jail for a very long time. I'm hearing somebody fuck with the wrong one. Somebody fuck with the wrong person. Somebody didn't know what they was getting into. So this leasing agency, this mortgage company, this landlord, I feel like somebody barked up the wrong tree. Somebody did not know. I feel like somebody could have took somebody for a joke. I feel like somebody's community or whoever you pay your rent or mortgage to, they have no clue that they're dealing with a divine being. They have no clue that they're dealing they're dealing with a chosen one. I feel like somebody could have like secret cameras around your home or somebody could have secretly put cameras in your house. They're going to jail for that. OK, I feel like somebody can. I, I, there is a lot going on. Your, your whole community, you may end up having to sue your whole community. I'm hearing I'm hearing people are very nosy. People are trying to figure out. Like where this I'm hearing something about some type of unexpected income. And I feel like somebody's feelings has been hurt because they thought you were ignoring them, but you weren't. OK, this is a weird ass download, a weird ass challenge. OK. Uh, is there anything else, spirit? Yeah, but whoever been hacking and whoever been breaking into your mailbox, whoever the fuck this is, they going to jail. And if there's the, I'm hearing if your community is involved with dig, yeah, there's some type of rumor or gossip going on. You might not even so you might not even get no damn money. Somebody could have just sent you a, a, a material item. Somebody could have sent you a T-shirt or some. I feel like your community could be mad because they can't get in your business. OK, or if this is an ex lover and you stay in the house, your ex lover, your ex friend and your family members could be mad that they can't get in your business. So they hire some type of fraudulent post office worker to break into your mailbox or it's like these people want to get in your business. They want to know how you make your money. They want to know how you do what you do. I feel like if you stay in the community, these people could be mad because you don't associate with them or something like that. It's like they're trying to bring it's like somebody could be trying to look into your background or see if you got like a criminal history history i feel like you don't even have a criminal history or record or if you do it's a minor these people are trying to find out what they can put on you i feel like somebody was lied to your community was lied to the neighborhood you stay in or your landlord somebody could have called and said that you were going to jail somebody could have called and said you was a criminal or somebody could have said you sold drugs or you sold your body i feel like yes a lot of people finna go to jail OK, and I'm hearing something going to be on the news. Something may end up going viral because I feel like somebody has some connections into the post office or somebody. If they don't have connections to the post office, they could just be breaking in your mailbox. I'm hearing if this is a landlord or a leasing agency, they, you're not the only person that they steal mail. OK. And I feel like you can have secret cameras in your home. You can have secret cameras in your bathroom. OK, you can have a secret camera in your uh, in one of your plugs or something like that. Somebody could have put up somebody. Somebody could have put up some secret cameras to watch you. They're going to jail for that, too. Somebody could have put a microphone or I don't know. These people going to jail. OK, I'm hearing Beverly Hill Billy's. OK, so somebody could be dealing with some trailer trash ass people. I don't fucking know, man. I don't know. But look. I'm hearing you about to move. Somebody's about to move. Okay. I feel like somebody's not going to have a choice, but I'm hearing you're going to be okay. This drastic change is going to be for the better. And who, whenever you move, you're going to go with this person that's been sending you all of this stuff that you have not received. I'm hearing your family may go to jail, a mother or father, somebody, somebody in your family, a parental figure, the, these people in the community, and somebody has a meth lab or something. Somebody been cooking dope in your neighborhood or something like that. OK, this could be a neighbor that's stealing from you, a landlord. These people going to jail. I'm hearing a slumlord. OK, and you need to download. If you're in the U.S., you need to download some type of app so you can see what your what what mail is coming to you. But yeah, expect a great change. Spirit telling me to stop and get off of here. Expect a great change. These people going to jail for stealing your goddamn mail. All because somebody could have lied and said you was going to jail or somebody could have called and said you was getting somebody. Oh, 
The spirit is telling me this wealthy man or this wealthy woman is federal agent or somebody. Somebody could have. Uh, somebody could have called looking for you and somebody could have said, no, you don't live on the premises or no, you don't, you don't, you don't own this home or somebody could discover that you really do own your home or somebody could have said, no, you don't lease this house or somebody lied. And I feel like this wealthy person now knows, or this is going to be somebody confirmation that you didn't receive the mail. OK, somebody knows or somebody already knows that you didn't receive this mail, this unexpected income. And I feel like this is a powerful man or a powerful woman. So this person could have actually tested these people just to get all the facts and the information that they needed. Your neighbors, your landlord, your mortgage company, your this leasing agency, these ex friends, these ex families, these ex lovers, they all going to jail for stealing some type of unexpected income that came in the mail and for gang stalking. OK, like, subscribe, and share, and download that app on, on the uh, U.S. Post Office. Bye, you guys. Like, subscribe, and share. Oh, and Spirit want me to say they got secret cameras hidden up. Hidden. There are secret cameras being hidden somewhere in your home. Okay, so you need to get some type of camera detector, or you may need to buy some cameras to get these, catch these people on camera. Okay, like, subscribe, and share. Thank you, and goodbye.